I'm not quite there, but but the good news is I am live, and we're gonna start the game here in just a moment. And here we are, standing by the fire as we do, and at the start of the game, and I have my arrow or my bow on. And look at that fancy, fancy. Well, okay, it's not very fancy cape that I've got now. I finally had enough bone to actually make one, so. Ooh. Press A. And we are going to the new world. I, I, I went to the Glade last night in very early morning, because I wake up, you know, I'll, I'll sleep and then I'll wake up and I'll figure, oh, I'll get on and try things. And uh, that was, I won't say it was a mistake, but it was a mistake, you know? <laughs> I ended up, uh, that, first seed that we chose was just so tough. It is so tough for a starting. But New World is so much better. Oh my gosh. Just, just say that. It is. And you know, I'm thinking, okay, I got this. I could do this. I got my leather pants and my leather shirt. Well, we'll just say that I got my stuff back except for the pants, and then I had to make the pants again, so, you know. <laughs> it was hard. And they were mean. And I was like, these dwarves, you know. Well, they're not, you know, what's so funny is, like, in the Viking thing, there's, like, two kinds of dwarves. We have the gray dwarf, which is part of the grayling... Um, whatever those, and then they have the dragor, which are um, like the, I think like the ghost dwarves or something like that, and so I, there's so many things going on in in this uh, potential things going on in Valheim that I'm like, oh, I haven't even hit the hard ones and I'm finding a challenge. Okay, so I am back here in the new world. I have 82 health. Um, I've had some good rest, I think. Um, it says I'm not rested. Oh, there we are. No, it's, it's daytime. Um, it is, but I'm not sure what time of the day it is. I think it's morning. And I think that's when I left off earlier. But... What I want to point out is that I slept here at the new house. <laughs> I, I, I slept in the new house. It's not too terribly well built, but it's, it's okay for me. Um, I made a fireplace connected to these, uh, to these little tent houses. I don't even know how to describe what's going on with this house, but, but it has a bed, it has a workbench, and it has chests that are empty currently. Um, and it has a fireplace, and really, I think what I'll do while I'm thinking of this is I'll come in and we'll make, uh, something to cook on. Yeah, because I, I kind of like being able to do that to cook whatever I have, so. There we go. Alright, better. So now this house is basically for me, ready to go as far as my basic necessities. Um, it is not set up to be like a level two, like my other houses. Let me see if I even have the ability. Oh, I do. All right, well. Let me make sure the chair is there. It sure is. All right, well, let's. All right, now it is a level two. But I've officially gone through, I guess, all my, um, flint to do this. Yep, so it'll be a gathering day, yep. I think I'm gonna put away the deer head and the beech seeds. But you can see where my supplies are at, basically, now from that, um, that run. I do have, like, a set of flint arrows with me. Um, the way the arrows work is it starts from the left and you see the highlighted arrow there and then it'll move to the next ones that you have down the line so that's how the arrows work and it, that's why I put it where it's at now um. All right. so open this empty chest and put the beach 
Cheatin'. Yeah. You know, that might be the way to do it, yeah, because they're just, you know, it's not... I am but one person. I do not need 12 houses in the same place. No. I... I... Well, it was the first house and I was in a hurry at the time. <laughs> it, was, it was going on nighttime and I was slapping down the... <laughs> I'm slapping down the rebuild on this really, really quickly. There was a, a grayling coming after me. Yep, this... Well, the sign doesn't say anything yet. I mean, I'm pretty sure I can put it... Actually, I'm pretty sure I can repair it. Let's do that. That is missing a requirement. Oh. Let me fix it so that I'm on the hammer. There we go. There we go. Uh, uh, what I'll do is I'll try and write something on the signs later. But right now, now we have a sign. Cool. It doesn't say anything. They're all blank. They're just a directional post there. We got feathers. We got feathers. And amber. Okay, I'll take it. It's too bad that I can't just um, grab this missing required crafting station. Okay, to break this down, I have to put a station down. How weird is that? But, okay, we can work this. We can work this. We need, we need like 10 wood or whatever, so I'm going to go and get some. Well, 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 yep, yep, we got a, we got a chicken hut or something over here. Um, not that I can see, and not that I can hear. I'm just going to leave it alone for right now, because I can fix it at some point, you know. Ooh, another chest. More amber. Ooh, more, more flint head arrows. I'll take that. Now, I, it, my understanding is that amber is kind of a valuable something later on. Yeah, yeah so it's nice to be finding it. Oh, and there's a deer over there. No chest in here, though. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And this looks like this is the start of a... What? Oh, I, like a boar pen, I betcha. This is... You could put... If I fixed all the fences around here... And I could lure the boar in... Then they'd be able to eat off the bushes. Kind of works for me. I'm digging that. Okay. And then this is just... Yeah. Yeah. So this is like an empty house here that I can get rid of that. And then that other one. Right. Well, interestingly, it let me get rid of that, but not this. So now I'm missing. It's like I'm just barely in the circle. Because it's telling me I can't build. And 
I'm like, well, I don't want to build. I just want to get your wood. This is that interesting. So if I stand in the circle of where my workbench is, I can I can reach parts. Well, yeah, but then I don't have the bench in the house, so I'll just make the bench here and drag that bench around. <laughs> it is, isn't it? Free bench wood, just, just with that. <laughs> But, let's see. I gotta go back to the hammer. Okay, why well, won't it let me bust down the bed, though? The bed won't go down. All right, well, then we will. Yeah. All right, well, I can test out the... I'll test something out here. Because it surely will bust down. Otherwise, what's kind of the point? Ah, there we go. The axe. Use an axe. Okay, so that's nice and neat there. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty good about that. Let me come over here. We'll take this little fence down. Because I'm, I'm going to make a better fence around here. I'm going to I'm gonna lower this ground here. Or maybe I won't. Maybe I'll take advantage of that for the fence. And just make a nice little fence going around here. Because I, I don't mind having several fences either, you know. I can't help but notice this boar has not been coming after me. The boar has not been coming after me, and that's been kind of... I wonder how... I wonder if... That's nice. I'll just... Um... Oh, yeah, I think if it doesn't come after me, I'll just... If it doesn't come after me, I will just leave it be. Okay. Let's try it. And I'm gonna try... RA maybe because I, I don't know if you can throw it I I know you can eat it I could have tried throwing it but Cause, um... well I don't know yet no I, I don't know that I'm gonna Well, since I can't figure it out anyway, you know, <laughs> we'll figure it out later. Oh, oh, no, no, don't bite me. I wasn't biting you. <laughs> oh, 
Sir, sir, I wasn't I wasn't bothering you. You weren't bothering me. Yep, that's what I was thinking I'm gonna have to do. You're gonna just have to go in the house for a little bit until it goes away. It'll give me a chance to rest up anyway. If my rest countdown is... Alright, let's go. Eat. Oh, it must be close. Well, that's why. You have to have the fire up for the rest to, to happen. Okay, all right. Oh, I can make a rug. We might as well make that. Right. No, he wasn't. But now it's dark, so I might as well do that. Yeah, I made a rug because it, it made sense to. There. I put a torch in, but apparently it's too close to the. The torches will go out if they're too close to. to have it right exactly there we'll see if that one nope does not like that uh, I guess uh, the fire is pretty good I mean it's, it's it's pretty bright so I'll just leave it there well, I guess we could try that yeah because We'll see if I can go around it later. It says I'm missing a requirement because I don't have any resin anymore. I could get the wood back, but I can't get the resin. So yeah, we'll find a few dwarves and that'll take care of that. Oh well, all right, I guess it's time to lay down. <laughs> When I first was laying down in this house, I had it right up against the wall. It would roll me outside. I rolled out into the rain. And I was like, yeah, that's not going to work. <laughs> so that's why the bed is where it's at right now. It is a very small house. And at some point, what I really need to do is just flatten out the area and make like a five by um, seven. A bigger house, yeah, and then, yes.
Yeah. But first, I need to acquire wood, I think, is our next step. I think we're out of wood, so. Well, no, we can't be out of wood. We've been... Uh, I'm out of resin, is what I'm out of. I... Well, you know how I went and fought the dwarves at the... <laughs> I, once upon a time, there was a lot of residents. They also got kind of um, left behind with the pants. I prioritized life over resin that time. <laughs> Nope, that did not fix the fence. That was the opposite. Let's try this again. Alright, that one got fenced. Alright, I'm just gonna mess with this house over here real quick. Yeah, got one fix. This did not have a chest, no. I, I think what we're gonna do is we'll keep the houses with the chest, but we're gonna let go of houses without the chest. Because what I could do, like, with one of the houses with the chest is, is maybe make it, like, a, a workstation area. Yeah, put, like, the tanning. Or, or, yeah, or storage area, yeah. Because I could see a use for having multiple buildings. I just know that since it's just me, I don't need a lot of buildings. Yeah, well, exactly. Well, you know, so... And then build. Yeah, me either, so. That kind of up area right here is a it's a, kind of a really a nice location from a protection point of view. And kind of flattish. I could make a bigger house here. And then um, build like the boar station or whatever. And it does, so it, it's something to think about. I think what I'm going to do is leave the workstation right there for right now. But so I could show you what else, you know, I did have a, a thing to show you. Because you will notice there is a pathway. <laughs> Now, it's not as lit and beautiful as my previous pathways because I didn't light everything up. Because again, I did not have the resin, but I did take the time to, to make a path. And this path walked past this treasure thing here. And then, um, and then, um, past the grave here. These are li my little icons here that I know about. Oh, let me collect this wood from, from whenever I did that wood there. All right, and then um, there's some raspberries over there. This path crosses uh, a bunch of little, oh, that's nice kind of spots, you know. And then um, it goes all the way down. Oh, there's a grayling, just a second, let me. Switch to the spear for this practice. Here, help me practice my spear. Also, I need resin. Once upon a time, I was a pacifist. It's not a thing. <laughs> but then they beat down on me, and I'm after them now. All right, so. I have 9 or 16, honey, yeah. I've actually... 
Yep, and and they do give me a lot of honey now. So this is this is my other house on the path, and and actually I think we walked past X here. The, I I think I just strolled right on past that place. The the Ekathir, um place. There we go. I'll gather a few mushrooms while I'm here, cause cause I can. But this goes all the way back down. I did this all the other last night, and so it comes all down down to here, back to the ring, the original ring. So now I know how to get back without having to try and figure out the map. You know. And then I, I spent some time lighting some of the torches, not all of them, but a couple just since I was coming back this way. I was going back and forth a bit. Let's see. They might have honey. Oh, they do have honey. They got three. I'll take them. Had four. They've been busy. You guys gotta work harder. Okay, but the bees are happy, so that's what's important. Alright, let's take a look at what we got. I got a stack of 50 here. Um, what I've been tempted to do is as I walk around, just leave stacks of wood around. <laughs> just as kind of a decoration. And also, you know, signs of civilization, even if it's just me. But I'm going to go take this wood back to the other house. Oh wait, no, I was going to show you my my uh, fire arrows. Just a second, let me see. I just have to remember where I put them. I think I put them over here, but I have to admit that I've been... Yeah, it might be time to start organizing this a bit more than I have. Um, let's see. I have some flint arrows here. Yeah. The majority of my stuff. Well, this is this was the first place that I landed, so it makes sense that it has the majority of my stuff anyway. Cause... Oh, there's my fire arrows. So, oh, I'm gonna take this deer hide and put it here. I've, I've got to accumulate my hide all over again, so that's why I'm kind of moving things around here. So I have six feathers now, which is far more than I had before. I can repair stuff while I'm here, yes. I see, I think there was food up, up, up here. Yes. Oh, well there is, but I'm... been heavily using some things here. There we go. And I might as well cook some of this food. But anyway, that's that's what I did last night was make roads, build, you know, fix the house up. Um, um, that is after I tried the glade. The cape, okay, if you, if you look at the armor, let me, um, I'm that. No. If, if you look at the armor, I now have a seven armor. So for every piece I have there, I like the leather hat and pants and shirt give two, and then the cape gives one. And actually what I ought to do is look at this, and see where, um, like that, uh, tanning station is. 
and then uh, we might be able to improve them even more. I, I do not. I, I will need to make it, but I think I have enough to make it now. So, as soon as this is cooked, I'll eat some food, and then we'll take a look at the build menu. But I kind of have to keep an eye on it, otherwise it'll turn to charcoal, and then... Yep. Alright, so, if I go to build... And I go to look at the tanning station. I need 15 flint, oh, 20 leather scraps, and 5 deer hide. I have the 5 deer hide in the um, chest, but I only have like 3 leather scraps now. I am going to have to go boar hunting. Oh, that's practice. And, and that's also grinding, so that's one of those that I'll have to do kind of behind the scenes and just... Um, practice for the spear and the and the air, you know, bow and arrow, and because if I'm going to boar hunt, I might as well use it as time to practice stuff, you know. The other thing I've been doing is going around the houses and make sure the fire's up, that kind of stuff. Fifteen flint, so I might as well grab him when I see him. It is my water, yes. My house by the water, whatever, yes. Alright. Birds, stay there, stay there. Or not. Like it saw me pull out the bow and it's like, nope, I'm not staying here. Yes, that, I, I'm thinking so, too. But what I realize is all, all of it needs practice. The bow, the spear, the, the knife, it just all needs practice. Um. Uh, I, w I will. I have not been thinking of the damn line, but I I'll start. That's you're right. I'm gonna need them. I know I'm gonna need them. I just walk by them because they're oh look at the pretty flowers. Yeah. No, this I do finally have enough to make a bed now. It might be. Um, I don't know. Okay, I think it's close enough. I'll just put it over here. I'm, I'm not gonna mark the bed here because I'm not actually staying here. I just came here to dry off essentially. But around here is like the boar um, Thingy, and I was hoping to see some. There's there's fish in the water. Oh, I remember what I was going to do. I can. It's just, you know, now that I have 50 stack of wood, now I have six, but that works out. Uh, I, I have a stack, so I'm putting it down. 
So I think like at every house, I'm gonna make sure there's like a stack of wood and I'm gonna try and make sure there's a stack of stone. You know. There's the boar stone over there. The, the boar stone right here. So in theory, if I wait around, I should see a boar at some point. Okay, a little to the right. Blew off already. Up and to the right, yeah. I saw that it, it flew off between me figuring out how to operate the thing. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. I wasn't really here for the bird anyway, so. It looks like a turtle there. Oh, there's a deer. All right. But it's got antlers. The ones with the antlers are the ones with the one star. So I'll, I'll leave those alone unless I'm just like really needing it. Oh, it's gotten foggy. Got foggy. Yep. Yep. All right, also I need to eat just a second. Yeah, one thing I learned in, in fighting those dwarves is you got to have that food. And you got to make sure you eat. Otherwise, um, yeah, that, that results in terrible things. The other thing I've learned, and I guess I just didn't realize that deer make noises, you know what I mean? That working sound, I guess they make noises. Yeah. Back at the house, one of the houses, anyway. We're, we're back at one of the houses, anyway. But I don't want to stay here overnight, so we're gonna take the path, we're gonna take a little run. Come and chop some of these trees down. It may not grass over, but it does uh, apparently grow trees. In the middle of the path, yeah. fall asleep on the on the sphere because yes <laughs> yeah I, I'll put him away when I when, when I wake up <laughs> I'm still laughing at the fact that I just thought I'll just lay down on my spear it does not automatically put these things away for you oh I'm starting to accumulate all right, I got two resin, which is like 
two more than I had before. Um. Yes. Well, there's, it, they're right outside the house. The dandelion. Yeah. All right. So, let's see. I think I've got food. I don't have to cook anything. I'm rested, so I think we're gonna go ahead and go back out. Or, or like another seed or something. Oh, oh, here, here comes the uh, Esther rallies the creatures, so. No, it's lunch, it's free lunch. That's basically what this is. Yep. It's the one thing that the beginning rally, I think, is designed to be the um, one where you can get materials without having to try to get materials. Now, the, the only things that don't come after you are the deer. The deer do not come after you. It's the, it's the grayling and the boar. Yeah, I guess we'll, we'll, we'll try the axe. One hit one right here. So the animals are calming down. But I, you know, this helped because I needed those parts, the, the boar scrap. So. It's sad for the boar, but good for me, is <laughs> basically. but I have to have 20. I got eight flint. I might go ahead and put the flint in here just to, you know, I'll just start counting. I'll put the meat in here too for right now. I'm gonna find the boar head because I know it's in here somewhere. There's that. I'm gonna take this out because I... I have seven feathers. Wow. Okay. I'm starting to get stuff together here. Fix everything. The nice thing is I don't have to worry about it for a little while because it's a 20% chance uh, for the, him to start calling the animals. And it's a 20% chance for him to start calling the animals to come out and get you. Like, uh, once per day it'll roll the, you know, is there going to be a challenge thing. But it does remind me I do want to build another fence, more fence around here. I know. I, if, you know, it looks good, but it's not doing a whole lot, you know. <laughs> Grab the wood while I'm here. Maybe another dandelion. 
I'm gonna go walk up and down the water here real quick and see if I can find some. Yeah, when I used it with the um, with the workshop, it just puts it up against my back, and so then I can just I can be hands free for a little bit while I'm walking around. <laughs> and it'll give me a chance to practice with my fists. There's Boar. I'm sorry, Mr. Boar. I'm just kind of following the river right now, I'm just kind of see how things I'm not actually trying to go after the neck. I'm, I'm really not. They're just... Yeah, the, the neck is food. It's, it is. But it's not as much food. It's like 15 instead of 35, you know. So worth getting, but maybe not pursuing, you know. Okay, so I guess this is where the river ends. It's a spring, I guess, here. But look at all these stones. All the stones, I mean, that's a lot of stones. broken down house. Yeah, I seem to be finding these. I can't tell. I can't hear them, but there's definitely a tree here. I mean, there's a tree right in the house there. It may bust the house, but Just a regular old house here. Let me see what my supply situation. I got 20 of 50. I'm doing all right here. True. Hello. Sorry, Mr. Boar, if I didn't need 20 of the thing, I would not be bugging you. Deer spotted me. I don't know how they spotted me, but I'll let him go because I'm not actually after the deer right now. Another treasure.
And it's a different one. <laughs> I know. I'm gonna have a place. I know. <laughs> By the time I do it, I'll have. I'm gonna need that pickaxe. Yep. For sure. <laughs> I got a lot, yeah, if, if, if we look at the map, if we zoom in, I, yep, I got one, two, three, four, five, six of these treasure things that I've found. Well, and there's another one right there. So. So, yeah, it's, it's a good... Um, good reason to go after, you know, X deer when, when I, oh, there's a deer with horns. I thought I had. Yeah, I marked it. I marked it. I just got to talking. But I think, um, I'm going to. It's gonna start being evening, so I guess I'm gonna head back to one of the houses. Let me see where I'm at on the map here. I'm closer to house yonder, so I'm gonna head that way, I think. Okay, there we go. I don't know that house yonder has a has a road yet. Here's your house. Okay, uh, I shall eat as soon as I'm at the house. Here we are. I'm gonna have to go back for those. I'll go back for them. You need to have a lit fire. Uh, yes, I know. I'm trying to fire. There we go. Now I have a lit fire. <laughs> All right, so now I'm safe and I can eat. They are, aren't they? They're just carrying this carry weight here right now. So what I might do is go ahead and put them in a chest. I don't have to carry everything with me all the time. I'm gonna keep the leather. I'll put the boar head away. I'm gonna, oh, where did I get feathers from? I guess I got feathers. So. Okay, so yeah, there were a couple stumps and a big log around here, so let's go and... And we can get our wood pile going here. Well, there's a bunch of logs around here. I think if if I could figure out the music, I think it does kind of tell you when it's noon and when it's um, closer to evening, but I, I haven't quite figured it out yet.
well, okay. I must have hit more buttons than I was aware of. Yes. Okay, so the sun is definitely setting now. My controller batteries are low. Okay. <laughs> so I'm thinking what we're going to do is we're going to call it good here. <laughs> and I think we're going to call it good here because my controller batteries are low. It'll give me a chance to... Um, go in, set the set point, and yes, and then... So we're gonna save while we're saving it's good because I think that also might have been what happened with my controller turning off you know it's, yeah so we're gonna hit log out and yes and, all right well that was fun and thank you for watching stop the live stream